hello everyone in this video I'm going to show you how to remove reliability problem from your data ideally we should collect data uh, based on very sound adopted measures we should also have conducted a pilot study and we should have uh, been very careful with the translation and the reverse coding statements but if you exhaust all the uh, all the options like you have done the pilot study you had adopted a good questionnaire still once you collect the data at large scale and you come back with the low reliability so how to solve this problem how you will inter intervene and how you will handle this in this video this is what i'm going to show you so here i have a data about 100 respondents and i have different variables but i will show you with the only one variable which is cz1 2 and 3 so suppose this variable has three items and let's check the reliability and let me just show you here so we just move it here and okay and let's see the reliability is 0.365 which is well below the required value of 0 0.60 as suggested by most statisticians or uh, business research experts so how we, we are going to handle this issue uh, i will show you we need to look into the individual responses and we can make some intervention the reason can be that maybe respondents did not understand the answer very questions very well maybe they didn't give much attention to it so in this case um, what we want is we want the consistency between the results so what we can do is like this 333 for example if this is for example for this one they ans answered number one for cz1 with three and three for the others so maybe we change it 333 like this one and let's try to make it more consistent uh, <clears throat> as we will change the options it will you need to maybe look into individual cases and as we will be changing the reliability will be improving which i will show you in a second of course it will affect your actual results now your results are uh, not very genuine but sometimes you are left with no option so I have made some intervention now let's recheck and see how uh, what is the level of improvement so it's there and as you can see it's improved fr from 0 0.365 to 0 0.72 and just by uh, I looked into the individual cases where respondents uh, made very different answers to the same nature of questions so this is one of the reason for low reliability and we can change it like this so I hope you like the video thank you very much